You have four wiffle ball bats. Four. It's wind related. We've been over this, Alice. <laughs> Stuart's about to get a wake up call. I'm giving you two months to figure it out. Stuart? You might want to get some mouthwash, sweetie. You taste like vomit. And now he's got one summer. I was five minutes away from the summer of my life. Well, last summer wasn't bad. Remember, we got bikes. To make the decision of a lifetime. I mean, all we have to do is grow things up a little bit. Like what? I don't know. Like not piss in people's bushes. And four friends to help him through it. Nobody throws a fastball in wiffle ball for Christ's sake. Fucking giraffe. Grab some roadies. We're going to a keg party. Top of the morning, fruits. Uh, you guys, there's a keg of honey out back. Make yourselves at home. What the hell's wrong with you, Juan Valdez? Nothing. Yeah, I'm a little stressed. Go off and shoot, though. Ow! You're younger than me? No way. How old are you? Because I'm 50. One, two, three. That's my man, Stu, by deep. Break it down. Debbie says that you aced the interview. Ah! Ow! When you have to choose between following someone else's dream. I found an awesome condo right downtown that we can move into instantly. Or trusting your own. I write greeting cards. Not like Hallmark shit. I I'd love to read some. Get that fucking hamster saying congratulations. And you open it up, you've mastered pathetic. All right. Leaving your friends. The league has decided to retire you now. Or making your future. Maybe I've been dicking around too long. And as you say, my nuts is withering. Mm, like a dying prune. Jesus Christ, you do. When your world meets the real world. You have. Kentucky Fried Chicken Utensils as your main utensils. What's the oldest age of a woman you've slept with? So, uh, what about you? Do you own any property? Me? No. No, I, I rent. That way I don't have to fix the shit box every time it overflows. <laughs> 81. 81. Yeah, but I haven't done shit here. <clears throat> oh, yeah, yeah, you haven't. It's not like you moved here with $72 and a lamp. Got a steady job, got a pretty cool place to live. <clears throat> Met a hot girl, founded a high profile wiffle ball league. I mean, you're already in business, my friend. In, in so many fucking ways, you're already in business. So where do you think Stuart is now? I don't know. Nebraska? <laughs> if I can hit the next pitch over the wall, I'll stay. Alley ball. Change begins at home plate. Okay, she didn't mean no wiffle ball at all, right? No, no, she couldn't have. I mean, the Crosstown Classic is coming. No, right, you can't stop that. It's like a fucking runaway train. I said, no, come on, come on, come on and love me, baby. Come on, come on, come on and love me, baby.